Chapter 11 Kadir offers to drop us at the home. On the way back, I don't speak a word to Josh. Kadir drops us off and leaves with Meena for lunch. Emily, come on, talk to me already, Josh says. Oh, it's okay, Josh. You don't have to put up with me. I won't eat your head off, I say, quoting Kadir, and start to walk off when his hand grabs my hand. Em, I didn't say that. You laughed, which meant you agree with whatever Kadir said. I say, not looking at him. His hand is still holding mine, giving me whites and butterflies, and I try to hold myself together. You've got it all wrong. I laughed because you two were funny or doing like that. And you were cute. All this sweet talking is not going to work on me. Right? I mean, he said I'm cute. He said I'm cute. I fight the urge to grin white and I bite the inside of my mouth to stop myself. Yeah, nice try. I managed to stop it off. No, I mean it. I've been wanting to tell you that since I saw you first today, but you were busy fighting with Meena and Kadir. Damn, I can't fight this anymore. I'm grinning now. Yes, and stupidly. What else can I do? You'd sure work your charm. Thank you, he smiles. Now lunch? I'm not coming anywhere with you with that makeup of yours. Okay, we can order and eat here then. Good idea. He lets go of my hand finally. He takes his mobile out and checks through the restaurants in Zomato. Buhari, McDonald's, Domino's, Anzip... Domino's! I want pizza. We go over the menu and order a medium deluxe veggie, two chocolate cakes, a garlic bread and a coke. How much is the bill, Josh? I ask, taking my wallet out. I'll pay. It's okay, I'll pay. Emily, I asked you to lunch, so I'll pay. That's what you said the other day for coffee. Except you didn't pay but uh, made me one. Because again, I had asked you. Duh. I guess next time I'll ask you. I bite my lip immediately. A smile appears on Josh's face. A super mysterious one. And I tell you, the smile is to die for. Guess that came out wrong? I laugh nervously. You mean you'll ask me out? Like a day? He asks with an impish smile. Definitely came out wrong. I say pursing my lips. Do remind me to chop my tongue off after eating. I say and he laughs. Looks like the kids are already asleep. Anyway, I'll get the table ready. I run away from the place, my heart beating in my throat.